MGT. What it do? It's your boy Moody Star, and I'm back again with another video. If you're new, you already know what to do, man. Become a subscriber, like the video, and join MGT. This is a channel where I like to highlight current events and talk about my spiritual walk here in this beautiful, fucked up, sideways ass matrix. Now, first of all, I gotta say a special shout out to anybody that's holding on to your energy, going within, and being high vibrational. Here at MGT, this is what we do. We work on ourselves every single day. All right. So in this video is not going to be too long. It's just MGT quick thoughts. Y'all can tell by the last video that I posted, it was very powerful. And if y'all know, then y'all know. If you don't know, you can go ahead and check it out. See more retention and dealing with negative events. First of all, I got to say thank you to anybody that did comment. Um, it really helped me out a lot. I should say that first and foremost. But in this video, I want to move on and just talk about how to kind of get to our goals uh, without overthinking, without stressing, things of that nature, you feel me? And just start with the simplest things. I always wanna try to break shit down. Like if you wanna tackle like a big goal, you have to break it down. You have to understand what the goal entails of. It's like people say they want a house, but they don't understand what a mortgage is. You always wanna do your research on whatever you want to get out in life. Google, the internet, things are pretty much at your fucking fingertips. If you think it, you type it, you can actually find some results on that that uh, that subject. Like, you know, so let's take advantage of the time that we're living in. You can literally learn how to do anything on YouTube. <laughs> you feel me? There's people every single day talking about how to fucking tie a shoe or how to, you feel me, on some random shit, but you'll be surprised, like that shit hit. So do your research, that's number one. Make five attainable goals that you can do today five attainable goals that you could do today consecutively for at least 21 to 30 days. And guys that are on their retention journey, bro, this is why it's so easy for us to experience, you know, the positive side of retaining our energy, bro, because we are constantly putting in effort to hold on to our seed every single day. Because we are already aligning ourselves to reach a goal, it will breed other forms of success. It's like, damn, I went 30 days of not busting a nut. This time around, I'm gonna do another another 30 days of not, not busting a nut, taking cold showers, um, not being on social media past 12 o'clock, or not even being on social media around three o'clock, you feel me? Because it'd be, it'd be wild. And a lot of people can't get to their goals because they are distracted, mainly, you feel me? They don't have something that they could do every single day, you feel me? The five things that they could do every single day to keep them aligned. Because what you're doing is you're setting yourself up to, first of all, be in the right type of vibration to receive the blessings that you basically been working for. You know what I'm saying? You are literally putting yourself in that right type of vibration so you're ready for the opportunity when the opportunity comes. Whether it's just drinking water every single day. That's the one thing that I did. You feel me? I still need to get back to that shit, bro. I used to wake up, drink water, and do 30 push-ups every fucking morning for a long, <laughs> for a long ass time. You know what I'm saying? And just because like my situation has been compromised, you know, I'm not going to lie. I kind of let it get to me a little bit, but I understand like if I if I was to go into idle mode, I'm not going to get shit done. You feel me? When you go into idle mode, you you will end up relapsing, going into some of the old things that you used to do or I used to do. I, I, I would say because, you know, everyone's different. But I know if I was to idle and if I didn't have some goals or something that I need to do today, every single day. I'd get bored as fuck. I'd, I'd start downloading whatever apps and start doing whatever every, everybody else is doing. And then two, two, three months later, I'm gonna look back at my life like, damn, why is my, why does my life suck? You see what I'm saying? It's because of what you did three months ago when you had the time. You feel me? To really, to really align yourself, to really put yourself in a position to win. And this is why it's very important to have attainable goals while retaining your energy because number one while you're retaining your energy you're you're more electric you're you're more attractive you feel me more things are going to be attracted to you good and bad you see what i'm saying that's why you need to know where you want to go in this matrix i always say have that inner gps system on and popping bro you always got to be in tune with yourself and in tune with your inner world because this your inner world literally guides you in the outer in the outer world which is which is here in the matrix. So again, if we don't have no sense of direction, you're gonna fail. Every time when I didn't have a sense of direction, I did some shit, low vibrational. From there, I um, got depressed. You feel me? From there, I, you know, just did not feel good about myself, dog, at all. 
because it's like, damn, my situation ain't changing and I'm not doing nothing to change my situation. That And then people wonder why like they, they lives suck. It's because either one, you scared to, to, to uh, face like some of the negative events that may happen in the matrix, bro. You have to like accept certain things and understand that you're bigger than this shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because if you don't do that shit, bro, it's gonna consume you. You see what I'm saying? So again, a lot of people worry about like, oh man, when is this gonna change? No, every day, look, whether it's five things or 10 things, anything that works for you, make some attainable goals. You will start to develop better habits. When you start to develop better habits, you'll have better ideas. You'll, you'll have more money making ideas than you actually knew. You, sometimes you have to write shit out. Sometimes you have to like, out of all your goals, like write out as much as you can. You feel me? Your relationship at work or with your kids, if you have kids, you know what I'm saying? Things of that nature, write out everything, kind of like rank the top five that's, that, that, that's really essential to you that will affect you today and affect you five, 10 years from now. Once you write that shit out and then now start to revisit every single day. Again, it's very hard for it. Like a motherfucker could write some shit. Again, this is the easy part is saying, you know what? I'm, I'm motivated today. I'm going to write out my goals. But a week later, what happens? We get distracted in the matrix or we, you know, we, we things, certain things happen. And now that shit, our list, we can't even get back to, you feel me? And I know because this happened to me plenty of times, but the key is we have to revisit back wherever we wrote our goals at to keep us in a vibration to keep going. That's why I say do something easy. Drink water every day. You feel me? Do 10 push-ups every day. It's not hard. You got 24 hours, 24 hours to do so much. And you can put it. This is why you got millionaires that are millionaires and like these celebrities, this is why they seem to be ahead because they've been putting in work. They've been planning. They made attainable goals. You feel me? You make attainable goal. Like my, my main goal on YouTube when I first started was at least a hundred views in one day. And it took forever for that shit to happen. But I knew, I was like, whatever. If I stayed consistent and if I said, you know what? I'm going to highlight what I'm going through as far as my spiritual walk is concerned. I, it's very good to, sh to share your story because you may never know. Um, you could be resonated with anybody on YouTube, depending on what you may be going through at that particular time of life. So I said, that's the value that I bring to YouTube, number one. And I'm walking what I'm talking, like I'm actually living this out. And I said, let me just be consistent. Let me keep this as, as, as a guide, you feel me? As like, st um, let me highlight the time and the moment and the, and the present time that I'm in right now because I know in different times bro like in the future there's shit that I'm talking about right now that I don't even know that I'm gonna um need five ten years from now but I know probably five ten years from now I know I'm gonna watch one of my old videos and I probably I'm probably gonna tear up you feel me because I'm already tapped in you feel me I'm holding on to my life force energy I'm outside usually when I'm outside by the trees I began some hella 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 good downloads you see what I'm saying? And sometimes, again, there's so much things in our mind. Create some space in your mind. Create some space of like, just, just, just being at peace. Even though the world may be chaotic. Because again, there's a lot of shit that's happening with me, but this is like one of the best times of my life, dog. And I'm, and I'm going through some shit, bro. You feel me? I'm really going through some shit, but like, at the same time, I am, I'm not content, but I'm very, I'm very well aware that I am on a journey. I'm going somewhere. So I have to make attainable goals in the meantime until I get to the bigger fish. Y'all gonna see that shit happen. Y'all gonna literally see it manifest before your eyes. Cause y'all, first of all, y'all holding me accountable. And again, all the, all the support, especially from the last video, I appreciate that shit, bro. It makes me, it makes me feel like I'm not out here alone, just going through this shit. So I really appreciate that. You know what I'm saying? So. At the end of the day, stay on your retention journey. Do what you do. Make some goals that work for you. You feel me? Not everything that I say is always going to work for you. But you know what's best for you. Tap into your inner self. Tap into your higher self. You know what I'm saying? Get some damn nature. Get some damn sun. You know what I'm saying? Don't let these people get in the way of what you're trying to get uh, accomplished. Don't let these women stress you out. Don't let some of these men stress you out. Because again, jealousy, envy, all that shit is real. And just because you already putting yourself in the right type of right type of vibration to be um, 
infinite and live in abundance, people will hate that about you. Guys will hate that about you because they, they're draining their energy constantly and they're always trying to compete with the next man. Nah, compete with yourself. Compete with your inner you. Compete with the old you. Compete with the future you. You know what I'm saying? This shit ain't nothing about nobody else but you, low key. You may have a family and everything, but at the end of the day, when you go to sleep, you're going to sleep with your thoughts, dreams, ideas, and your soul, your spirit, your experiences. So, like, know what you got to do here out in, here out in this uh, matrix. I'm about to end the video. Make sure you like, share, comment down below. I'm going to definitely see you guys on the next video. Y'all boys, keep your heads up. And I thank you guys for all the love and support, bro. Especially on that last video. If you missed it, definitely check it out. Um, again, it's me, your boy, Moody Star. Like, share, drop down in the cash app. I'm definitely, definitely see you guys. I'm fumbling with my words today. I'm going to definitely see you guys on the next video. Peace.